Alright, I made a new track because the game deleted mine. I'm like, uh, fuck it, I'll do another, another one. Alright, let's see who is going to make it. Uh, Freeway, Pete Bros, Pinball. Let me just put the names here. Yeah. You can see how it's very not balanced at all. But some take the the just the loop, the others take the middle playing here, and they usually just come around at around the same time, for the most part. Let's see who's winning here. Do I have Mr. Command in there? I gotta remove that because I played already. And it's Sprint Master, River, Cross Force, and somebody's exploding, and it's Meteor Defense, the one. Alright, let's go there. Let's do it. No idea how to play this. I guess I just keep shooting. The Meteors. What was that sound effect? <laughs> that song, I guess? Let me too loud. <laughs> Hold on. Uh, I don't think I can pause it. I can probably press it one. Hold on. Might need to lower the volume a little because it seems like it's too loud. <laughs> Just maybe. All right, we should be good. <clears throat> Did I restart? I think I. Oh, my press F1, I, I restarted. Okay. That's okay. Okay. It seems like a standard Atari sh spaceship shooter game, you know? Definitely never heard of this one. I guess the sound effects are for when ships are coming toward my way. So gotta give priority to them because the sound effects are not good. <laughs> it's very loud. That's just meters, I guess. <sighs> Hit that. Get out of it. Get away from here. Please don't. Don't be loud. Oh no. Do I lose if I... They just pass by, I do not lose? Hmm. Stop it. <laughs> Extremely loud. I'm guessing the thing on the left is just like garbage, pic uh, garbage pixels. Because whenever something is spawning there, it just shows a little bit on the left. That was definitely not a good sound. Like, I'm not supposed to let the things pass me by. Okay, I got a thing. That was going to be... Oh, they're moving fast now. Okay. This is as much as this is as far as I can move to the right and to the left. Cannot be way ahead of them. Stage two, possibly. Okay. It's very hard for me to see. Actually, <laughs> what the fuck? They get so faint. I guess if there's people that are color blind, they'll be having a hard time with this shit. Like it just kind of hurts the eye. And I'm not even color, but it's just like. Whoa. I'm not expecting that. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> yeah, I guess the thing on the left is definitely not supposed to be appearing, but. I'm gonna leave it there. Can you shoot it? Thank you. Yeah, this is your standard Atari shooter, you know? Not much to say about it. Except that this color scheme is terrible. Whoever decided on this color scheme is just like... I kind of have to look away from it a little bit. It is not pleasant to look at. I still don't get what the 8 vision down there means. And the 2x home. <laughs> I still don't know. <laughs> Okay, the seven and the eight is my my lives count. I definitely lost one. The two X home, I still don't know. Can I change level, please? This color is terrible.
At least the meteors are moving faster. Oh, I die if I don't kill them. I lose a one up. Okay. So some meters I can just let go through. The ships I cannot. Or whatever they are. Okay. <coughs> if I'm closer, I can shoot faster by holding the button, which helps me a lot. I was pressing the button every single time, I can kind of just... Holy shit! <laughs> I cannot! Okay, it's called meter defense, but if the meter goes through, I don't die. But if these things go through, I'm done. So the flashing is something else. Did... Did it level me down? I... It's so precise, it's so weird. Okay, stay on the yellow. Okay, it's slightly better. There's a spider on my wall. I'm like, uh, holy shit. Okay, let me just be careful with her. <laughs> I guess it's a spider that doesn't hurt me, but she's definitely getting on my table. Can you not get in here? <laughs> okay. Oh, no. She's on my arcade stick. I don't like it. <coughs> I'm choking on my spit. <laughs> it's definitely almost getting impossible. <sighs> By almost, I mean uh, it's getting hard. Well, this is in the beginning, now it's just getting rough. So again, this color scheme is not helping me much, but... I think that's up. I'm probably dead. It's hard. <clears throat> it's hard to see. <clears throat> These are moving so fast. Uh, okay, I got it. Maybe the things on the middle I cannot let go? What happens if I let go of the ones straight up in the middle? How could I get in there? In time? That is rough. Guess I have to be in the middle and just shoot them? Ignore most of the meteors, I guess. <laughs> it was so fast game. It's whiffing. I'm whiffing shots. This is not good. Shoot it, please. Thank you. What was making this weird noise? I guess I died and I got a one up. I'm trying just too fast. This color scheme is definitely better. Holy shit, game. Thank you. No, I guess I missed one down there. Is it over? It is over. Okay. Uh, okay, it's okay, game. Go for a different one. And there we go. After meter defense, let's see who is going to win this one. Hold on. Where am I? I pressed something here. I don't know how to leave. Get out the screen. God damn it. 
What did I press? Okay, it's gone. All right, let's see the camera number one. Venture, no, Super Box is winning. Now it's Steady Apple. I never heard of it. Let's move the camera backwards a little bit. And Venture in Shooting Gallery came at the top. Came on the front. And Phantom Task is this, but the explosion is going to stop them. And who's going to make it is Backfire. The second one was Outer Space. It was not, it was Racquetball. Then Super Box, then Outer Space. All right, Backfire it is. Let's go. Let me see. This one is kind of slow. What the fuck? <laughs> I guess I lost that one up or something? I died. That's it. Oh, if I miss a shot, I'm fucked up. This is not shaking right now. This is hard. If I shoot myself, I also shake like crazy. <laughs> okay. I feel like this is probably one of those games that were not officially released back in the day. This is probably like a ROM hack or a fan made game. And that's it? This is so weird. Is that every time the screen shakes, it's a... a life that I lose? By screen, I mean my ship. Or whatever I'm controlling. So the fact that it can only use one shot. It's kinda hard. <laughs> oh no. Yep, one more time. Okay, this is hard. Try again. <clears throat> There's too many barriers, which is hard. Game, I, I don't have an opening here. Finally. God damn it. Okay, focusing. Oh no. Okay. I guess I have four one ups. Oh my god, I almost killed myself. Oh, the whole ship shaking is kind of too much. Got it. Okay. Uh, maybe I'm playing like two player mode. That's probably just harder. Because the ship at the top is probably second player. That is definitely not playing right now. Mm -mm. God damn it. Mm -mm -mm. Ah. <laughs> I love this sound. It's so much. I actually meant to miss that. Uh -oh. All the things are also shooting at me. My last one up. The little things in the middle, they also shoot. Not bad, it's just like eh. It's kinda kinda boring. The fact that you just lose one shot and there's just this one plane flying in the middle. I got a little decad, okay. Oh, this is over. Ah. Okay, so you have a one-up. I guess I got a one-up. 
and I shot myself. Okay, uh, that's that's a game. Uh, I guess maybe it's like a co-op game. I don't know, or one versus one. Anyway, let's go for a different one. Let's see who's going to win. Uh, the marbles are falling from the pachinko shit. I think they are rolling downhill. The ones on the loop go faster. The track is smaller on the middle, so by the end of it, they mostly come out at the same time. For the most part, but it doesn't matter because there's a still a thing on the end that just makes them not exactly go at the same time. So let's see who is winning. And we have Cubert and Surfs Up and Go Cubert. And the one that's going to win is Freeway. I'm not sure I've ever heard of this game. Let's see. Let's go there. All right. Everything seems in order. Let's maybe try this game. And three, two, one. No. Okay. All right. And we gotta cross the street as a chicken. <laughs> Did I already get it? Come on. Isn't there like a joke about a uh, chicken crossing the street? There he is, right? In Portuguese, I'm pretty sure there is. I'm not sure what is it in English, if there is one. <laughs> Ow, I made it. Okay. Is it only like two player? Isn't there like a progression? Okay. Ah! <laughs> Almost got hit. Alright. Just wait a little bit. Yeah, see, it is just points. Oh my god, I pressed the wrong button. We reset it. Okay, so we can see the different speeds, levels. Okay, we can try. Like, getting to 10 points in all difficulties to see how it is. What the heck? Okay. As it doesn't seem to have anything extra. I also gotta raise the phone a little bit, I think. <clears throat> Alright, let's start again. So let's start at 1. Okay. Let's get to 5 points on stage 1. My goal is to complete 5 points on every single difficulty stage. Because I think this game is just... It doesn't have a natural progression, so it's just like 2 players and you see who does more points. Four, okay, one more. and five, easy. Let's go to difficulty number two. It's definitely harder. <clears throat> Can I make it? <laughs> Jesus. Uh. Okay, one. <laughs> two. All right. I mean, just three. Okay, two more. I think there's eight, eight difficulties in here. Which probably happens naturally when you're playing the game normally. Oh no. <coughs> so I guess there's no lives. It's probably whoever makes the most points in a certain amount of time, maybe. Oops. Four. I kind of like the cars just honking. The sounds are pretty good. Okay, five. Let's try three. Can I get it without getting hit? <clears throat> uh. <laughs> yeah, that was close. God damn it. Okay, restart. Restart it. Can I cross it without getting hit? Mm, nope. Next one, okay. Nice. One. Okay, I got one without getting hit. Uh, uh, two. <laughs> that was tight too. I cannot move left and right. It's just up and down. Mm. No. Three. Okay. 
kind of weird not having a timer limit or score limit or something. It's like it's just playing the game. For playing, unless you... Whenever I reach, I don't know, 20, 20 crossings, I win. To the player 2. Against player 2 or something. Probably some arbitrary number. Okay, stage 4. This one seems to be easier. It's more... Organized. There's a pa clear pattern you can see. Okay. Yeah. It looks way easier. Three. And I just got impatient. Four. <coughs> and five. All right. Difficulty five. It seems the same. Oh no, the they change speed randomly. Okay, let's go to five. Because they speed up and speed down. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Interesting. Okay. So the fast ones are going slow sometimes. Two, this should be easy. Ish. Three. Oh, oh, it almost hit me because it went slower. Okay, four. And five. Alright, next one. Wait, can I control chicken number two? I cannot. I can probably control it. Control it if I just have my controller set up for that. I was gonna try to control them both at the same time. It's not going to be good. Okay, number one. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah, damn it. Two. Okay. Three. Good. Four. One more. Ah, I did not move forward. Come on. By forward, I mean upwards. Okay, five. Difficulty, seven. And there is just one more after this. Ow, my back. Okay. And one. <coughs> Two. <laughs> okay. That's close. Ah! I was surrounded. <laughs> God damn it. The bottom one went faster. Should be three. I almost saved that. Four and five. Less difficulty is this one. It's more more randomized. The pattern, the pattern was pretty clear on the first one. Now it's just speeding up and speeding down. It's just a little bit harder. One. Can I cross at least once without getting hit? Okay, this one was without a hit. Two. Oops, go back. Again, those games that are just multiplayer, they are usually the best for Atari games. Because they are simple. When you're just competing against yourself, you get kind of bored. Like the for one of the first ones that I played that is just like jumping across while the screen is scrolling up. And you gotta be hitting the bottom ones before the scrolling just kills you. It's like so much fun in multiplayer, I'm guessing. If I had to play with someone else. Okay, freeway pretty good. Let's go for a different game. And start. Okay. I made my track very short, so the races usually do not take longer than 30 seconds. I'm still not that happy with the explosions here. All of this shit. Just like cheap ending, just slowing down the balls without randomness. It's weird. I might put an extra spinning thing at the end so I can get more randomness, I guess. So uh, Ocean City Defender and Donald Duck Speedboat, they are leading. And then it's Forest. And who is going to make it? It's Xenophob. Xenophobe. Okay, let's go there. And uh, we're spawning. We can crowd, we can jump by pressing up. Of course, because there's only one button. 
we can shoot is this thing on the bottom something that i can pick okay sprites flickering that's normal whoa <laughs> if i'm moving forward and i jump i get a big jump this is interesting oh this hits me it's bad i didn't know about it okay if i crouch i grab this shit which i think it's points whoa <laughs> die He's destroying my health bar. Just keep moving. He's about to kill me. Okay, that's an interesting game. So far. So I think it's cutting a little bit at the top. Hold on. <laughs> Let me just uncut the top of it. Yeah, kind of like this. Also a little bit on the left. Okay, like this. <laughs> Let me search a little bit about this game. Is there any information anywhere? It seems like a game that has a backstory to it. <clears throat> Xenopho Atari. Manual, maybe? It's so amazing there's a lot of manuals for those old games, you know? <clears throat> Every effort has been made to ensure the accuracy of the product documentation in this manual. However, because Atari Corporation is constantly improving and updating its computer hardware and software, it's unable to guarantee the accuracy of printed materials after the date of publication disclaims liability for changes, errors, error, or omissions. 1987, Bali Midway. Alien attack! Hostile aliens! Xenophobes are infesting space stations vital to your planet security. These aliens threaten to overrun the stations, rendering the space stations useless. You're part of an elite team who is ready to speed to these and other space stations. Your mission is clear. Destroy the aliens, regain control of the space stations, and pick up va any valuable hardware you might discover as you sweep the stations for aliens. Aliens are a swarming band of uglies. Straight up your worst nightmares. You need to use your talent just to stay alive. The message has come. It's up to you and your teammates to cleanse each Space station of aliens. Your mother ship brings you to the vicinity of each overrun space station. To put on a member of your elite squad or work on your own to clear. Getting started. Da -da 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 -da. Press the fire button. Split screen. There's split screen. Interesting. Okay. Let's see. Let's see. Split screen. Let's see. Split screen. Interesting. Okay. Up jumpy. If walking, creeping, or standing. Stand up crawling. Da -da -da. Number of levels. Nine. It's each space station has eight rooms on each level. You must open doors as you move from room to room. Just step up to the door to open it. To reach a different level, you must use the elevator found on each level. While standing directly in front of the elevator buttons, push up on the controller. Finish a mission. There are three ways in which you can finish a mission to a station. Each of the three missions endings offers an increased number of points. If you take too long and clear the space station, the aliens overrun the station. The amount of time you have to clear the space station depends on the difficulty level and other factors. Destroying some aliens, but finding and using a self-destruct, but finding and using the self-destruct code to destroy the space station is an acceptable ending. Okay. The best ending for mission is the destruction of all aliens on a space station without destroying the space station. To all aliens space station within the, the minimum amount of force needed to destroy a particular type of alien is as follows. Critter part that's called Roller Baby, Roller Baby, and Snotter Pillar. Okay, the things I found on the ground is just points. It's the hardware. Weapons, you start with a phaser. You also find weapons scattered throughout the space, and she's points available. Okay, fists. Phaser, laser piece, electric rifle, puffer gun, and grenade. Dangers, jump into a door. Okay. Tentacles are getting attacked. Grenade strategy. Locate them as easy as possible. Dealing some clumsier and easier to queue at lower levels of space stations. Okay. We probably got it, the gist of it. So there's eight rooms per attempt. Did I change the name? I did. 
Yeah, let's try again. So I probably need to hurry. This is supposed to be something. I thought there's someone in my ass already. It's kind of bullshit. Did they take my gun? I believe they did. That is bullshit. <laughs> okay. It's kind of unfair. Do they move between screens? I don't think they do. They had some out of this world vibe, kinda. To it. Get away from me. Okay, I still don't know if I can kill this shit. Just moving there and I kill them and that's it. Okay, base cleared. 300 per Xeno killed. That's an interesting, interesting game. Never heard of this one. <clears throat> so I got a base cleared. I'm kind of afraid of pressing anything. Uh, can you? Okay, it just proceeds on by itself. I'm not sure if I can kill these things. I guess they just become something else. <laughs> yeah, they don't seem to die. Okay. So the speed of my attack is tied to the distance that I am from them. Interesting. Okay. Oh, shit. I got a grenade. Okay. See, Nora, this is the cats, okay? Leave me alone. Are they evolving or something? It's kind of hard to tell what is going on with them. I still have only like a punch. Mm, this is not good. God damn it. These guys don't die. Okay, this is definitely a gun. There we go. Like, this is definitely a sprite for a gun. Which is, looks pretty cute. Get out of here, stupid egg thing. Tell me with my gun. Okay. It's supposed to be the elevator, right? Okay. There we go. Press up. Okay. Can I jump in here? Got a better weapon? I'm not sure. You bitch. Okay, I killed it. Oh, come on. Come on, kill me. Did I lose my fast gun? I think I did. Oh, I changed between weapons. Ah, how did I? 
No, leave me alone. Okay, one more run. It's kind of fun. Kind of weird that some monsters seem to not die. Like this shit. I still don't know what's going on here. Okay, cannot collect it. Cannot press up. It's a grenade. So I don't have a choice. When I get a grenade, I cannot switch weapons because there's only one button on the Atari. Okay. Oh, come on. Ah, oh, you piece of shit. It's definitely hitting me. Oh my god. Big ass alien, leave it alone. Okay. Okay. I guess I just leave the big ones. I was going to get the big grenade and just go back for the big guy, maybe I can kill him this way. Try this level again. <clears throat> hmm. That was a one eight. God damn it. I recognize the one thing. That is weird in the ground, it's a grenade. Okay. <laughs> God damn it. What is this shit? It's just gear? Uh, I need weapon. There we go. Oh, come on! So it says sniper because my shot go faster. No. I'm telling that I lost it. Okay. Nope. Oh, jump over it. Okay. Can I press down instead of up? I cannot. Only up. Okay. Can I go to the right? I can and I died. Hold on. I sped it up too much. Let me go back. Okay. No. Nope. Uh, leave me alone. You get this. Can I even kill them? Possibly not. I killed them, okay. They died. Okay, it's an interesting game. I feel like it, there's some strategy involved, but it's just like... It's hard to tell which ones die, which ones do not. I don't know if that's an egg that I cannot kill. I don't know. Interesting game.